I'm gonna tell you real quick if you're a bed bug customer and you've got bed bugs and you're a civilian and you're not a bed bug exterminator not all exterminators know about bed bugs I'm gonna tell you how not to get ripped off okay first things first we have a box spring right here you got somebody you're getting ready to pay a thousand three thousand eight hundred whatever dollars the technician comes in on the day of the job and you're watching him and he doesn't have one of these flashlight he's not a he doesn't know what he's doing I mean you're in a dark room with an overhead light or a, a lamp on and you're gonna look for little microscopic creatures without a flashlight I'd kick him out of my house or her whatever so uh, here's another thing I see so while you're doing here's the box spring right the box springs flipped over there's a what we call a dust cover all right this dust cover that's made out of felt gets thrown in the trash so you can spray all of this wood that's up in here you know this is where you're gonna find them right here you know on the front of the box spring these little uh, these little grooves you just move these around little um, little hiding areas so you're not going to find anything at Home Depot or online made out of apple cider vinegar and unicorn horn extract and, uh, you know, angel tears that's going to get rid of bed bugs. It's not going to happen. Laund I see so much crap. People read on the internet or they got a $4 bug spray. Listen, if there was a $4 bug spray that got rid of bed bugs as an exterminator for the last, I don't know, almost two decades, don't you think I would know about it? You know what I mean? Like, I'm just telling you. And I'll go one step further. And, and this is going to trigger some responses. I, I would never heat, use heat, because bed bugs detect heat, and you can't heat everything up to 140 or whatever degrees it is. And you can't fumigate everything. Now, if you're going to heat and fumigate and spray a residual pesticide on all of this stuff, that's one thing. But to do it alone, you're going to have problems. Don't ever fog them yourself. Fog is not the way you want to go about that. That should be, you know, that's just craziness. Fog just makes them go somewhere else. You know, you might kill a couple of them, but number one, those foggers from the store that are $4 for a box of eight, well, you're getting what you pay for. So I've been a bed bug exterminator. I had a bed bug business. I've been, I've done all kinds of pest control from bats, bed bugs, trapping, you know, possums raccoons um, termites subterranean rodent proofing i've done it all and bed bugs i just see so many people get the wrong information and i'm just telling you you're gonna get ripped off